Hi everybody, I'm currently seal coating the driveway at the project home. Now I've got some large cracks in the asphalt and some large cracks in a concrete sidewalk. Now I've used products in the past where it's a liquid and you pour it right into the crack. But what I've found is if it rains suddenly out of nowhere, it washes away all that hard work. I found something that's my go-to material that I love and I want to share with you. And what I like about it is if it rains, you got no worries because this stuff sets up almost, well, not instantly, but pretty doggone close. If you have asphalt or concrete repairs you've got to make this summer, I got to tell you I'm doing it. I have a driveway that's asphalt and I have some sidewalks that have a few cracks and I got to tell you that there is no better material to use for filling cracks in my opinion than ply sticks. Now this on the left is for asphalt, this on the right is for concrete. And let me show you how easy it is to use. Now this is what the product looks like unboxed and up close. It comes in rolls of 30 feet. It's pliable so it's easy to cut and it can fill cracks in concrete and asphalt up to a half inch wide. Now whether you're repairing concrete or asphalt, you want to take a hook knife and you want to thoroughly clean out the crack you're going to repair. Then you want to take a broom or a brush or a leaf blower and clean out the area thoroughly. Now once you have the area that you're repairing thoroughly cleaned out of vegetation and cleaned out with a brush, it's time to apply the ply stick. And if you need to, don't be afraid to take a tool and really force that ply stick into the crack. Now you may find that you need to stretch the ply stick to accommodate a narrow crack. So don't be afraid to pull it a little bit, to tug it, because it's designed to, you know, it's designed to stretch. Okay, we're all done and ready to go. Now if you have deep cracks, you may have to double up in a few areas. Now the ply sticks, they need to be melted. And to do that, well, I'm going to be using map gas but you can also use propane. So you want to take your torch, fire it up. Now just that quickly, it's dry to the touch. So there we go, our crack is all repaired. I'll make certain that I place a link in the description below the video so you can check out ply sticks for yourself. This is Leah saying you, you can do this. See you next time.